Hi, my name is Kim Peterson, and I am the founder of Uniquely Savvy Inc. and the creator of Move from Fear to More Freedom and Create a Life You Love, a women's group coaching program for women in transition. Now, ladies, you may be in a transition for many different reasons during this season in life. It could look like a transition in your career. Perhaps it's a transition in your relationships. I like to say, most importantly, the relationship with yourself is, is the one that you really want to hone and cultivate. And perhaps that's the one that's causing you some angst and some friction right now. It could also be a season of transition. Just after coming out of these last few years, you are ready for a reset right now. You are tired of being poked and prodded. You're tired of being tired. You're tired of um, self-doubt and angst, and you want more clarity, more confidence, more joy in your life. If that's the case, I'm excited to tell you more about this program, but for right now, I want to introduce you to one of my six guest experts, Tracy Washington, who is bringing uh, a topic that is so needed right now. She will be talking about how to move beyond grief and loss. We have all on a global level experienced that to some degree over the last few years. Let me tell you a little bit more about Tracy. Tracy Washington is a leadership engagement consultant, certified as a human behavior consultant and a grief recovery specialist. She is the author of the relationship leadership philosophy and creator of You Be More Confident, executive coaching for women. Tracy has worked with organizations to refine strategies on leadership development, inclusion, and improving employee engagement strategies in navigating change. Tracy, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for having me, Kim. I'm so excited to be here. Oh, I don't know who's more excited. But <laughs> hey, listen, I just wanted to ask you a quick question as I've really been thinking about the women that I've been coaching. Um, how does grief become an obstacle for women who are wanting to pursue their dreams and experience more freedom in their lives, whether that's professionally or personally or relationally? Well, uh, you're doing great work with women. So it's such an important topic that you would bring this to your women. Grief is uh, an emotional response to loss and, and how we've been adapting towards the pandemic, all the things that we've lost. Grief is one of those things that can hold us back if we aren't equipped with the right tools to go forward. Mm -hmm. And so what I want to talk about with your ladies is what are some of the patterns of grief that you might not even be aware of that can be holding you back? What are the beliefs? What are the events that caused your grief? Because grief is not uh, intellectual, it's emotional. It's not about a broken brain. It's about a broken heart. So many times we're trying to fix the heart with the head and it's the wrong, wrong too. We don't, we're not broken. People say, oh, I'm so broken. We're not broken. Our heart is broken. And we have to correctly identify those things that could be holding us back, those unresolved feelings of grief and loss that we haven't quite dealt with because we haven't identified the patterns or behaviors that could hinder us from moving forward. So they can expect to find out what are the the events, maybe some of the beliefs and some of the patterns of behavior that hinder or help in moving forward. That is so good. So good. And you know, what I just wanted the listeners to know today is I know you have, you know, your own lived experience of overcoming uh, grief. And I also know that you and I had a great conversation about how um, it's important for all women to be having this conversation and yes. professional women, because not only does this hinder our dreams, it hinders our ability to be productive and to be um, optimizing uh, ourselves in our professional career. So I'm so excited to have you. I cannot wait. And uh, to all of you who are listening, if you are struggling with grief um, and, or you're in a season of transition and you are ready, you are hungry to get after taking control of your life and defining what's next, 
with a group of like-minded women who are not only cheering you on when you're victorious, but also helping you understand setbacks and move forward. I want to invite you to click on the link below to get an understanding of what the program's all about. I'll be coaching consistently throughout the six weeks on a variety of topics. And of course, we have these experts here as well. If you find you're on the fence and you just don't know if this is the right solution or if this is the right time, I want to invite you to a complimentary clarity call where you and I can talk about what's unique about your season of uh, transition. And I can understand better what your goals are and what your setbacks are. And we can get some clarity around this to see if this is a good fit for you. That said, Tracy, thank you so much for your time today. I look forward to seeing you in January. Absolutely. Yes. Exciting times are ahead. Everybody have a great day and bye for now. Bye now.